Examining the world's most dangerous countries sheds light on severe and ongoing crises. These regions are characterized by intense violence, political instability, and deep humanitarian issues. From conflict-ridden areas to those overwhelmed by crime, the difficulties these nations face are both profound and multifaceted. Here are the exploring the top 10 dangerous countries. Number 10. Syria Syria, torn apart by more than a decade of civil war, has become one of the most dangerous countries globally. The conflict has reduced cities to rubble, displaced millions, and allowed extremist factions to gain ground. What is daily life like for those who remain in this war-torn nation? The nation's rich historical legacy, once a source of national pride, now serves as a grim reminder of the destruction and loss. Despite multiple ceasefire attempts, the violence persists, leaving Syria's future uncertain. The resilience of the Syrian people is remarkable, but how much longer can they endure such extreme hardships? As the conflict continues, the human cost grows ever higher with no clear end in sight. Number 9. Afghanistan Afghanistan remains engulfed in violence and uncertainty with the Taliban's resurgence throwing the country into a state of flux. The constant threat of terrorism, coupled with ongoing conflicts and a fragile government, makes it one of the most dangerous places to live. The stories of those who strive for a better future amid the chaos reflect the resilience of the Afghan people. The withdrawal of international forces has left a power vacuum, raising fears of further instability. Despite these obstacles, there are glimmers of hope as communities work towards a peaceful future. But can these efforts survive the relentless pressure of ongoing conflict and instability? Number 8. Yemen Yemen is suffering through one of the most severe humanitarian crises of recent times, worsened by civil war, famine, and disease. The country's infrastructure lies in ruins and the relentless conflict has made daily life a battle for survival. The tragic impact on Yemen's children facing malnutrition and a lack of education paints a bleak picture of the future. Is there any hope for recovery, or has Yemen reached a point of no return? The blockade on essential supplies has only deepened the crisis, creating an urgent need for international aid. The resilience of the Yemeni people is tested daily as they navigate a landscape filled with landmines, airstrikes, and starvation. Can the global community find the resolve to end this suffering, or will Yemen remain a forgotten conflict? If yes, then comment below. Number 7. South Sudan South Sudan, the world's youngest nation, has been embroiled in conflict since its birth. Ethnic violence, political instability, and widespread poverty have made it one of the most dangerous places on Earth. The struggle for power has displaced millions, forcing them into refugee camps with little hope for peace. The promise of independence has been overshadowed by years of brutal civil war, dashing hopes for prosperity and unity. Despite peace agreements, violence frequently flares up, undermining efforts to build a stable state. The humanitarian crisis is severe, with millions in desperate need of aid and basic services. Can South Sudan overcome its deep divisions, or will it remain a symbol of unrealized potential? Number 6. Somalia Somalia, burdened by decades of civil war, terrorism, and piracy, remains one of the most dangerous and lawless countries in the world. The lack of a stable government has allowed extremist groups to thrive, turning large parts of the country into dangerous zones. The resilience of the Somali people is extraordinary, but the constant threat of violence makes daily life incredibly risky. Efforts to establish a central government have been met with resistance from powerful warlords and extremist factions. Somalia's strategic location has also turned it into a battleground for international interests, complicating peace efforts. Despite these challenges, Somalia's rich culture and history continue to persist, offering a glimmer of hope. But can these cultural ties withstand the pressures of ongoing conflict and fragmentation? Number 5. Central African Republic the Central African Republic teeters on the edge of collapse, with armed groups controlling vast areas of the country. Political turmoil, ethnic violence, and a weak government have turned it into one of the most dangerous places to live. The humanitarian crisis has left millions in desperate need with little hope for safety or stability. The international community has struggled to mediate peace as rival factions continue to fight for power and resources. The country's rich mineral wealth has only fueled the conflict, with armed groups exploiting the chaos for profit. Despite the bleak situation, local communities have shown incredible resilience in the face of adversity. Can their efforts be enough to break the cycle of violence, or will the Central African Republic remain trapped in a state of perpetual conflict? Number 4. Iraq Iraq, still struggling after years of war and the threat of ISIS, remains a volatile and dangerous country. Sectarian violence, political instability, and ongoing terrorist attacks make it a place where danger is never far away. The scars of conflict are everywhere, yet the people of Iraq continue to push forward, determined to reclaim their country. 
Will peace ever truly return to this war-torn land? The challenge of rebuilding Iraq is compounded by deep sectarian divisions and a fragile political system. Despite these difficulties, there are signs of progress as Iraqis work to rebuild their cities and lives. But can these efforts overcome the deep-rooted issues that have plagued Iraq for decades? Number 3. Venezuela Venezuela's rapid decline from prosperity to chaos has made it one of the most dangerous countries in the world. Political unrest, economic collapse, and widespread crime have left the country in turmoil. How did a nation with such potential fall so far? The daily struggle for survival, where food, medicine, and basic security are scarce, is a harsh reality for millions. The mass exodus of millions of Venezuelans fleeing the country's dire conditions has created one of the largest refugee crises in modern times. Despite the grim situation, there are pockets of resistance and hope where communities come together to support one another. Will these efforts be enough to spark a turnaround, or is Venezuela destined to remain in crisis? If you leave yes, then comment below. Number 2. Libya Libya, torn apart by civil war following the fall of its longtime dictator, has become a battlefield for rival factions. The power vacuum has turned the country into a war zone with extremist groups fighting for control. The ongoing violence has left the population trapped in a cycle of fear and uncertainty. Is there hope for peace, or will Libya remain a land of chaos and conflict? The struggle for control over Libya's vast oil resources has only intensified the conflict, drawing in foreign powers and mercenaries. Despite these challenges, efforts to broker peace continue, though success remains elusive. Can Libya ever find a path to stability, or will it remain a fractured and war-torn nation? Number 1. Honduras Honduras, with one of the highest murder rates in the world, is a country where violence is an everyday threat. Gang warfare, drug trafficking, and corruption have turned cities into some of the most dangerous places to live. How do people find safety in a country where law and order seem to have broken down? The impact on daily life is devastating, entire communities living in fear of the next outbreak of violence. The government's efforts to combat gangs and drug cartels have often met with limited success, leading to widespread disillusionment. Despite the dangers, brave individuals and organizations are working tirelessly to bring about change. Thank you for tuning in. If you enjoyed the content, please hit the like button and subscribe to stay updated with our latest videos on YouTube.